Grand Rising, everybody. We're going to be doing an all placement, all sign read. This is going to be a general collective read for everybody. Okay, so if this is your read, it will resonate. And if it's not, it's just not going to. But keep in mind that you can click that red subscription button right now. If you're not a part of the Soul Family, do so at this time. Become a part of the Soul Family. You are invited to if you're waiting for your formal invitation. Please do welcome yourself to join by clicking the red subscription button. We love to have you. And so we're just going to be doing a read from the On The Grind deck. We're going to be looking into your finances, seeing what is or what is not coming in. Give you a little bit of clarity for today. All right. So whenever this comes up on your timeline is when it is significant to you. This can be your energy or someone that is in your energy, past, present, or future energy. So let's see what we have here. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, spirit. spirit got a lot to spill a tea. It says, be sure to stay realistic. All right. Don't plan to overspend. Maybe you've been, you know, unrealistic about your spending, how much you have actually coming in. You might be spending out more than what you have and you may be going over how much you should be keeping in order for you to be able to able to have a safety cushion which should be at least three to four times um or four months worth of expenses that you need to in order for you to take care of whatever it is you take care of now in order for you to get by and sustain in life or just have the comfortable life you're used to having but you may be overspending or feeling like um, whatever position you're in or whatever, you know, income you're generating that is actually going to be here for a while. But you may be getting ready to take a hit. So you might um, need to be careful and watch your finances, especially if you have them in banks with the banks, a lot of the banks collapsing. All right. And the government having to take over and some of them not being FDIC insured. Meaning that if it's not insured and your money is in that bank, then you just lose all your money. If they lose it and they're not backed by the government, then you lose everything. Even if you had $200,000, just it's gone. So be sure to be banking with someone if you're not right now. Bank with someone that's FDIC insured. So they can at least cover... 20 20 to 30 or possibly up to 50 percent of your whatever you deposit they have that on reserve for you if anything was to happen all right so we got hospital coming out in reverse all right it says medical field health care um you could um you could use to work okay if you were in the field of the medical field you may have lost your job recently which could be why you need to be realistic about your finances because you don't make the amount of money you used to make in the past or someone that's in your um, energy doesn't that was working in the medical field they could have been a nurse any type of nurse under any scope under the scope of being a nurse any specific field under that or they could be a doctor any specific kind of doctor that goes for surgeon and things of that nature um and then we have a therapist so a shrink or a counselor anything of that nature fall under that scope but you may not do that anymore if somebody doesn't do that anymore they just lost their job what else do you want for us to know spirit before we go to the tarot deck Somebody was overspending and they wasn't keeping track of their finances. They feel like they had enough. They had finances coming in from other ways. And, you know, something fell through. And, you know, they was thinking that whatever job this was would always back them. But they lost the job, too. Or somebody put their job on the line, risked their job, and lost it in the midst of whatever they were doing or whoever they were dealing with. It says one minute each day to check on financial transactions. Take a daily uh, money minute 
But somebody isn't checking on their finances. They don't know how much money they have. They just be spending, 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 thinking it's going to be there. And eventually it's going to get declined real soon. Somebody's money got recently got declined, going to the bank, or is getting ready to be declined. All right? Somebody's money is not going to be there. It's all going to be gone. Or recently it was gone. Somebody could also be a... Um, one of the banking recipients who lost their money um, recently during the bank collapsing. Somebody could have been a business owner and their money was in one of those bank accounts. Somebody must um, was thinking about, you could have been recently thinking about buying a car, but it's not time. To do that, that that must be what you want to do because I'm saying that um, it's time to treat yourself. You want to um, go ahead and buy that car. That's that might be what you're saying. That might be what you want to do. Yeah, you like I said, you your own boss. Um, you may have recently taken a hit, or somebody did. That's in your energy, or someone is their own boss. It says your own boss in the comfort of your own home, convenient hours, your peace of sanity. Someone is a boss, but they lost their money um, recently in this bank situation, or they will be with a bank situation. The bank ain't going to have the money there. It's going to be gone, or somebody is going to steal from their account in some way or another. It's going to be compromised, their bank account, or your bank account. Someone in your energy, if this isn't resonating, that's great. All right. But that's good to your own boss. Just hopefully you make sure that, you know, whatever, whoever you're banking with is FDIC insured. Spirit, what do you want for us to know? Ace of Cups, a new beginning. Yeah, you might have to start over. I'm gonna have to start over, go somewhere else, bank with someone else new. Okay. Not gonna be left out in the cold. I'm seeing that though. Someone that you're married to is going to come in and help you out, or somebody you get married to. Page of Pentacles. Somebody who you may reject getting help from because you feel like you have it all. But this is somebody who sees you as a star, and that is, you know, marriage material. If you're not married to them, they're planning on it. Um getting married to you so they don't mind stepping up and helping you if you don't have any money to get you out of whatever situation or any you know bind you might be in yep somebody could be a leo heavy aquarius gemini um well i didn't mean to say gemini so gemini might may definitely be significant here all right might be a twin flame coming through to help you out um but we also have taurus Scorpio and Leo, as well as with the cups out here and pinnacles we have and wands. So we pretty much have um, everything for air. So we have Leo, we have Aries, Sagittarius, we have Capricorn, Taurus, and Virgo, and we have um, Pisces, Cancer, and Scorpio. Pretty much everything but Gemini and Libra out here. Yeah, somebody wants to help you, but this is someone who wants to help you because, you know, they see you as wifey material and they want to manifest that and definitely want to be in your good graces. So they want to definitely come and get you out of this situation and pretty much be your hero. <laughs> Spirit, what else do you have for us before I close this out? King of Wands. This could be someone who's not um, vocally um, speaking with you, but they may come through and help you if they know that you're in a situation or they're aware of your circumstances or something around your business. They're going to come through and bail you out without you even knowing or being aware of it. They could be helping you behind the scenes. Yep, you don't know because they know that you will say no. So they're not even going to expose to you that this is what they're doing. With the sun coming out here in reverse, Leo, somebody is going to be hiding what they're doing. They don't want you to know. Yeah, they're being sneaky about it because they feel like you're not going to accept it. But somebody's taking a leap of faith to do it anyway, even though you might be pissed off, ready to hurt their ass. 
Did somebody know that you left them out in the cold? You seen that there was no growth in the past and you left. Yeah, this is somebody you're not in a relationship with. You may view them. You may have left them with somebody that was an ugly person and yeah, left them stuck. Somebody thought that they was going to make you fall in love and now um, run away and leave you. And you walked away on their ass when you became enlightened. So somebody know that you're enlightened and they know you're in a situation. They feel sorry for what they did. So they want to change things so they can come back in your life and start a new cycle with you and a new beginning. So they will no longer be left out in the cold. So they no longer will have to feel like you don't fuck with them anymore. They try to earn their stripes back. And they are willing to do so by, you know, helping you out financially. And hopefully you see that this person really cares for you and that this person is your person is what they're hoping. And that they'll be there for you um, pretty much whenever you're having a hard time so that you are willing to take their hand in marriage. <laughs> somebody or somebody want a long term commitment where it's just you and them. Even if you don't get married, they just see you as the person that they grow old with and be with and like you're their end goal. The end game. But it's not the end of life for you, but, you know, end of them playing games and being out in these streets. Um, but we got um, 10, 4, 10, 5, 10, 6. We have two. No, we don't have two. So Aquarius could be significant. We have 4, 5. We have 4, 6, and 4, 10. We have 5, 6, 5, 4, 5, 10. 10, 4, 10, 5, 10, 6, if I didn't say that, and 6, 5, 6, 4, 6, 10, we have Gemini, we have, but that's coming out in reverse, so somebody is no longer um, involved with someone, somebody is no longer lovers with someone, or someone sees someone that they were dealing with in the past as them not being their, you know, compatible partner to be in union with, and then we have um, Taurus coming out in reverse. So somebody could be a fake. Um, Taurus is the higher font as well. So somebody could be a fake um, spiritualist. All right. Somebody could have been dealing with a fake spiritualist that they cut off because um, with the 10 coming out on, on the side sideways, that is Libra energy. Somebody could have been unfair blocking someone from getting their justice or being, you know, with this person who they're having to go and bail out. Somebody would have never even end up in a situation where they need to be bailed out if they wouldn't have been blocked by, you know, someone from their past who was standing in the way from these two people being together. And so someone is coming in to change fate and um, realign it to make it where it, how it's supposed to be. But um, we have the emperor coming in for his imprints, basically. But that is what I have for you guys. So, guys, please do thumbs up the video. Make sure you subscribe to my channel as I was welcoming you to do so. And I'll see you all real soon. Until next time, have a blessed, a prosperous, and fulfilled day. Bye.